It's all in a day's work for Ahmed Majoud. Cobras, horned vipers, scorpions are tracked down by this 38-year-old snake hunter. A dangerous profession, but above all, a passion. I love this job. I've got it in the blood. I used to watch my father and my grandfather hunt snakes when I was small. I've always lived with animals. It's something which is normal for me. That's true for the rest of the family. No one blinks an eye fondling iguanas or even scorpions. I grew up, like my children, seeing my parents fearless of snakes. It's the same for my kids. I play with snakes. We catch them all, even lizards. Most of the snakes snared by Ahmed end up in this scientific center. Here they make antidotes to snake venom. Ahmed sells 1,000 reptiles a year to the center, a business which brings him from 8 to $45 a specimen, depending on its rarity. With regard to snakes, we have more than 1,500 specimens, including those which we call unusual snakes. And for others which are rare, we have 10 or 20 specimens, like the snakes of the Sinai. Several hundred lives are saved by the antidote each year in Egypt, mostly farmers or soldiers. But during his more than 20-year career, Ahmed has never had an accident. He's convinced that's because he's protected by the power of the cobra, just like the ancient pharaohs. For him, there's no question of stopping. He's already thinking of who will carry on the family trade.